Victory Magello has put you right back in the hunt for the LMP2 Pro-Am title. How would you sum up the season so far, the first five races? I mean, yeah, Mugello was uh, was great with his victory. Uh, we are back in the in the championship after Mugello for the title this weekend, and uh, and yeah, he, the season is went really good so far uh, with two two victory, one in Paul Ricard, one in uh, Mugello, uh, with two podium also uh, P2 in uh, in Barcelona and P2 in Imola. So went really good, uh, and uh, now we are fully focused for the last race. Is that consistency the key to a championship? Do you think? I think is the yeah in a, any championship uh, the consistency is the is the key, and uh, we need to yeah to to be focused on that. The level here is is fantastic. You know, there's eight cars, there's 22 cars in LP2, but you've got to remember there's eight cars in Pro Am as well, and the level is is fantastic. How have you been finding that challenge? It's really good. Uh, like it's it's always good to have this uh, this level in a, in a championship. Uh, there is some great battle. Uh, it's uh, really close between uh, each other, so between uh, between different team, and also uh, yeah, the traffic is quite a, a challenge here with all the GT different category and MP3. So it's it's really good. Yeah, yeah. Endurance is all about teamwork. It's not just about you, you yourself as a driver. You've got two of the teammates in the car. You've also got a team of people behind you. Tell us about the Richard Mill by TDS Racing. Of course, for me, it's, uh, this year it's uh, something new uh, because uh, before I was in single seater, so it, I was only working for myself. Uh, and uh, and now this year, it's like all the team uh, with my two teammates, with Matthias and Rodrigo, like we are working really close each other. And also with the world team, uh, where we work like, yeah, it's more or less like a family, and we are working really hard to to progress uh, in uh, in uh, each uh, yeah each session. So yeah, it's really it's really great. How are you finding that switch from single seater? Are you enjoying it in endurance in sports cars? Yes, uh, I really enjoy it because from the start, uh, I really love to share my. Uh, my um, my thing, my what I think about the track, about some corners with some uh, some different some other drivers. So now I have two two teammates to share that, and we progress all together. So it's it's fine. Perfect. We're here in Portimao, and I think it's fair to say it's been described as a roller coaster. You've had a few sessions out there this weekend in different weather conditions as well. What do you think about this track as the host for the season finale? Yeah, it's my first time here. Uh, I drive for the for the first time yesterday, and uh, it's a really really nice track uh, with uphill downhill, as you said, like a roller coaster. And uh, I really enjoyed this track. Uh, we we drive in the I drive in the damp uh, track yesterday, and uh, and also today on the dry, and I really enjoy it. I think the traffic won't be so easy like uh, like in Mugello. But uh, it would be a challenge, but it's, it's, it's the same for everyone. So now we need to, to push until the end. Is there a, a section of the circuit or a corner you, is, you really like? I mean, the first pass with the double, triple right, if we can say that. Mm. Uh, like T1 really fast and then uh, you have a, an air pin after that. It's, uh, it's quite nice here. Yeah. With the championship race so tight, are you approaching this weekend any differently from the previous five races? Not really. Uh, we are, as always, focus on our race weekend. Uh, the goal it will be to to take the win uh, for this race, and then uh, what we want to achieve uh, will be there. So yeah, I'm take, we are we are taking this race like another, and uh, and the goal is to to get the win for the race, and of course the the, the title at the end. Well, thank you very much for an entertaining uh, season so far, and good luck for this weekend. Thank you. Thanks for coming out.